Hello everyone. I like to share with you a few trees that they posted on Friday, 7th of July 2023. These trades were shared by Castro or Global Instructor, who is trading Nasdaq CFD. As you see here, the market reached an area of the static support. This is the ideal area for setup B. So Castro entered in this area with setup B with very good risk to reward ratio and managed this one and closed this with profit. So thank you, Castro, for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades were shared by Jan, our global instructor, who is trading Nasdaq futures. If we look at the macro chart, we see that during the pre-market session, uh, there was a news that the price went up and later got rejected and started to go down. So this area of downtrend was identified in the trading chart and he took sell short in this area. And when the price reached this static support area, he identified this as a good area for setup B and later setup T and entered multiple long positions here. So we see that the results from six trades are positive and shows 100% win rate with the average winning trades of about $23 and the largest winning trade of $40. So thank you, Jan, for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades are those that I have taken during the New York market session and the video with detailed explanation was sent to students yesterday. So I'm gonna replay the video here for you. Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you the trades that I have taken today on Friday, 7th of July, 2023. These trades were taken on NASDAQ and Dow Jones and also S&P 500 futures. If we look at the macro chart of one hour, we see during the Globex session, the price was fluctuating around the previous day close and for some of them reached the area of the previous day low such as Dow Jones and for others went half the way such as S&P and Nasdaq and bearish came back during the news and also London session and we see during the New York market session if we look at the five minute macro we see that the price retested this area again and got rejected and the buyers came back so I started taking long position around 940 when the buyers came back at this point. So I took long position on NASDAQ here, as you see, and also on Dow Jones, you see from 946 to 948, I took long position in this area on these two candles. And the same also on the S&P 500, took long positions on these two candles. So these signals were copied by copy trader to multiple Apex Trader Funds accounts and the result was positive and shows that we reached profit factor of 99 with the 94% win rate from all these long positions and the average win to loss ratio was 6.77 the largest winning trade was 740 and the largest losing trade was $24 so hope this trade taken by the PAT system is useful for you and let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day and also weekend.